shocking moments that changed sports entertainment forever. These are the six most heartbreaking losses in WrestleMania history. The Rock and John Cena talked so much trash before their WrestleMania 28 clash that it became a must-win for both of them. Cena was about a millisecond away from spoiling The Rock's Miami homecoming, but he made the fatal mistake of attempting the people's elbow on its creator. The Rock celebrated his first one-on-one -on -one victory in 10 years, while Cena sat on the entrance ramp with a thousand-mile stare. The distraught look on his face will long be remembered by a generation of Cena fans. Just before Macho King, Randy Savage, and the Ultimate Warrior battled in a career-ending match at WrestleMania 7, Bobby Heenan spotted Miss Elizabeth anxiously watching from the crowd. After the Warrior prevailed, Queen Sherry added insult to injury by berating the Macho King. When Sherry laid her hands on Savage, though, Elizabeth said no more. She hopped the barricade and rushed to her former love's side. It was the reunion the WWE Universe had waited years for, and the lack of dry eyes in the building proved it. Shawn Michaels didn't want to do it, but he had to deliver sweet chin music. Ric Flair insisted. And when he connected, it brought Flair's in-ring career to an end. As soon as the bell rang, HBK hugged Flair and made a beeline for the locker room, refusing to have his hand raised to celebrate the win. The Nature Boy wiped away the tears while the Citrus Bowl gave him a standing ovation. The Rock had never defeated Stone Cold Steve Austin at WrestleMania. Austin spent the night before WrestleMania in the hospital, but he battled back and left everything in the ring against his longtime rival. Rock drove Austin to the mat with three ring-shaking rock bottoms to earn the victory and end Austin's in-ring career. Before Rock could celebrate, though, he sent a special message to his greatest adversary. Booker T was firmly in control against Triple H at WrestleMania 19. With every move, though, Booker's left leg became worse. After he connected with a devastating Harlem hangover, Booker couldn't put weight on his leg. He went for one more scissors kick, but his leg gave out, allowing Triple H to capitalize. The game escaped with his title, and Booker T laid in agony, knowing he came so close. Even as Brock Lesnar hoisted The Undertaker for a third F5, the WWE Universe didn't really think he could end The Undertaker's streak. With 21 straight wins, it seemed the Phenom would never fall on the grandest stage of them all. When the bell rang, though, the streak was over, and the crowd was dumbfounded. You could hear a pin drop up until a haunting 21-1 appeared in the arena, and the crowd collected. 